I'm not gonna scream, it's way too late at night. What's going on YouTube? It's James with Shy Hammer Fantasy and it's the road dog, Jesse. Oh, Jesse James. <laughs> All right, we were talking about our recap of uh, games one, two, and three on day one at Adepticon GT. And uh, Jesse brought up a really funny story to me. Um, he was playing another ogre player because uh, as you guys know, my brother plays Ogre Cons. Brogers. Brogers. Broger Cons, exactly. And um, he got charged by four Tuskers, a unit of four Tuskers, against his unit of three Tuskers. And at the end of that combat, that unit of his three Tuskers were chasing down the four Tuskers. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty funny, man. <laughs> That's pretty funny. The other thing that he just mentioned was how he uh, he realizes every time we go to these events that he's the chauffeur to all these YouTubers. We drive all the YouTubers around. OB, uh, Lord Tremendous, Kieran. Kieran. Yeah. Did you get Vince or no? I've driven Vince to Wendy's before. <laughs> to Wendy's? Yeah. That's hilarious. Oh, man. So uh, talk to us about your games, Chewy. So my recap for today, got two solid wins, 120 and 0, 119 and 1, and in my first game I got a really big loss, uh, it was uh, 1 to 19. What army did you play in game one? Game one. Oh, it was the, this guy that I played. Yeah, I played the, the Empire. Empire guy. Uh, just bad rolls, got, I lost uh, my unit of tribesmen, which I was, I was hoping would stick. It didn't stick, and that ended up losing the game for me. What unit hit your tribesmen? The big one? Yeah. The big unit, the, I don't know, they're like, peasants. They're, they're not peasants, they're empire, but they're like, they only have a six up armor. Yeah, that unit hit me, and uh, I, I thought, I was pretty sure the tries were going to stick, but he got some good buffs on it. Rerolls to wound, rerolls to hit, yeah. Yeah, he, he, I think he has hatred automatically because the character's in there, yeah. and then he gets the rerolls to wound from the bomb spell. And then I had distracting on me, so I was hitting him on fives. It just was a bad combination. He, he played it well. It was, good. It was a good uh, good game. And then um, game two, I ended up playing uh, what's Todd's army? Todd Gee? Yeah. Uh, Beast? Beastman. And Beastman uh, just sat back, uh, was watching, you know, uh, letting him move around. For uh, the right opportunity, I struck, I hit him. Uh, I got uh, a nice side flank with my tribesmen to his uh, Minotaur uh, block. And uh, the thing is, he popped up his uh, dogs in the back. And when he popped them up, he popped them up at an angle where he couldn't uh, turn his Minotaur block around. <laughs> so, he chaffed himself he up. Chaffed himself up. <laughs> so my uh, unit of tribesmen had a big flank the whole time, ranks, banners, um, and they were they were hitting his two guys, and he couldn't do nothing but two two guys back at me. He made snake eyes, though, right? He made snake eyes he, once. He made snake. That's and, hilarious. But he couldn't uh, he couldn't turn around in combat reform, so it was stuck. So. Once I took out that Minotaur block, I took out his other his big block of uh, Ungers and um, with his uh, Lord in it, and it was a wrap. And then my last game was against um, some Ogres. Uh, ogres, I uh, it was mirror match, as you heard earlier. I took out a unit of four Tuskers with three Tuskers. <laughs> That's uh, and uh, after he got charged. Yeah. <laughs> Ended up pretty doing pretty well. Ended up with 19 points in that game. That's crazy. I uh, I actually played uh, Lord Tremendous, Dark Wizard Gaming, and then I played uh, man, what was his name? Evershade or Ever? There, I played three YouTubers. I did. Charles Sandler. Yeah, I know it's Charles Sandler, yeah. but but he's like a he has a YouTube channel. Yeah, he does. It's ever something. I know it when I see it, but I won't know it right now because, of course, I draw blanks at the moment. It's like almost midnight right now. <laughs> and we're driving back. I said I took care of my dog. He said I took care of his dog. And, uh, yeah, so anyways, play three YouTubers. So you're going to see double battle reports on the first three games. Um, and then um, I think uh, 
Well, actually, I take it back. Mike Lies didn't make a battle report because uh, his battle reports are usually in like a studio setting, so he didn't have all his stuff with him. He did have a really. I'm, I'm gonna be honest. Like I, I, I watched like one or two of his battle reports. I, I know he played uh, what's his face, uh, Gabriel Thorne, and that one has a bajillion views just because Gabriel Thorne's army is beautiful. But, um, but like playing him in person, he has all the tokens. Everything's laminated. Everything's neat. And I'm over here with like broken pieces. Like, yeah, that's charging that. That's charging that. This guy has like nice charge markers and everything. I'm like, what the hell, man? He even had a nice felt uh, dice box. <laughs> I was like, man, I feel so ghetto. I got, I got tape in my fucking box. <laughs> I don't, it's just that there's so many dice that the box doesn't close properly. You need to tape it shut. Oh, man. Anyways. Uh, Take some of the dice out. I did take some of the dice out. I get new dice. I even stopped giving away dice. I was like, I don't even have dice to give away. They're all unique dice now. Anyways, um, yeah, but I played him and he had, I'm not gonna lie, he had probably one of the toughest lists I fought. Um, I'm gonna give this to John653. Uh, I fought John653 like, I don't know. John, you're the man. John, I fought you like, I guess like 10 or 12 times. I'm, I might be exaggerating quite a bit. But I fought him on UB a lot, like every other night, when I'm not playing the creep and playing John. And John runs this Death Star of Barrow Guard, uh, Grave Guard, whatever they're called now. I think it is Barrow Guard. And I realized Black Orcs with, um, against this Barrow Guard, um, are not a good matchup. They're just not. He's hitting me on threes, wounding me on twos, and, uh, <coughs> And uh, he'll just tear me up, and by the time I get some wounds in, he's gonna restore his wounds. So it's just such a shitty matchup. And uh, what, uh, so I, I realized, like, not to deal with it, but at the same time, Mike Lies had that put it on the table, and I was just like, oh, I know better. I know better. I'm not going for it. <laughs> but um, yeah, none of us got the objective, and it was just a back and forth game of who's gonna take the objective. And um, there's just a couple couple of shitty situations that I'll give you guys the highlights. Um, I charged in with two chariots and the space rock into a giant unit horde of like, I think it was double the starting size, so 90 skeletons. Jeez. And I killed 40. I maxed out six on Thunderstomp and, and uh, double sixes on uh, impact hits. Killed 40. Four rounds later, I'm still there. And there's 70 more skeletons. Jeez. Yeah, what the hell? What the hell was that? It was just so many damn skeletons. That's not fair. <laughs> oh. Anyways, that was that was the hardest game I played, and I was playing really like intellectually. As intellectual as I can get. Um yeah, but um anyways, that's our round one recap. We know we know our matchups for tomorrow. I don't know my matchup. They might change me because they messed up my points. My opponent, he won uh eleven nine before objective and then I got the objective. So I, I just gave you guys spoilers, but whatever. And um so I got a twelve eight, but the guy who put it in the computer didn't read it that he read it as the person who won got three points extra. So anyways, <coughs> um, yep, so that's that. We're going to see you guys tomorrow morning. I have a long night, or I don't have a long night, I'm going to just knock out tonight. I'm kind of like too hyper to knock out though. <laughs> I probably will after I walk the dog. Anyways guys, take care, see you next time. Got any final words? See you later YouTube. Peace. Peace.